solving the absolute value equation and inequality. As we studied before, absolute A, in the absolute we have three cases, maybe positive number, zero, or negative number. If the number which is inside the absolute positive or equal zero, that means the number will be remains as it is like. If it was three, it will be three. The answer will be three. It will, if it was four, the answer will be four. So absolute A, when A greater than or equal zero, still A. But what about if uh, the case of negative number? If inside the absolute we have negative number like absolute negative three, now A equal negative three. The output, the output will be three, right? That means negative A. So in the case of A less than zero, the output will be negative A. One of the important property of the absolute value that if we have x minus 2 equal to minus x, what does it mean? The, me uh, the meaning of x minus 2 is the distance between x and the number 2. Here we have an example like 5 minus 2. The distance between uh, 2 and 5, it will be 3 units, right? But if I said that absolute 2 minus 5, it's still meaning, the, the meaning is still the distance between 2 and 5, and also it will be 3 units. So absolute k minus a equal, uh, sorry, x minus a equal a minus x. Solve the equation. If absolute x equal 7, that means inside the absolute may be x equal 7 or negative 7. If absolute x equal negative 2, of course, we need to find the value of x. In this case, there is no solution because there is no answer for, there is no absolute number equal negative number. Solve the equation. 3x minus 3, absolute 3x minus 3 equal 6. If the, the answer equal 6, if the answer of the absolute equal 6, that means inside the absolute may be equal 6 or negative 6. That means maybe 3x minus 3 equal 6 or 3x minus 3 equal negative 6. We are going to solve the two equations and find the answer. First one, 3x equal 9. Finally, x equal 3. Then, 3x equal uh, uh, negative 6 plus 3, it will be negative 3. Finally, x equal negative 1. And to make sure that your answer is right, substitute 3 times 3 equal 9 minus 3 is 6. And 3 times negative 1 equal negative 3 minus 3 equal negative 6. And also the, the answer will be 6. Absolute x plus 4 equal 12. That means inside the absolute we have 12 or negative 12. So I'm going to solve the equation. First, x plus 4 equal 12. Then x plus 4 equal negative 12. Solve the first, x equal 8. The second one, x will be negative 12 minus 4, negative 16. Finally, x equal 8 or negative 16 and substitute uh, in the equation. Put x equal 8 and negative 16 and find the value to make sure that your answer is right. Finally, I can say that the solution set equal 8 and negative 16. Absolute value equation, another example here I have. Absolute x minus 2 plus 4 equal 8. First, find the value of the absolute. It will be 8 minus 4. So, absolute x minus 2 will be equal 4. Finally, I can say that inside the absolute may be 4, may be negative 4. So, x minus 2 equal 4 or x minus 2 equal negative 4. Solve the two equations. First one, x equal 6. Second one, x will be negative 2. Then, the solution set equal 6 and negative 2 to make sure Substitute with x equals 6 and negative 2 to find uh, 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 the value of the absolute, it will be 4. If 6x minus absolute 6x minus 3 equals 15, that means inside the absolute maybe 15, maybe negative 15. So 6x minus 3 equals 15 or 6x minus 3 equals negative 15. Find the value of, uh, or solve the two equations for x. First one, 6x equals 6, 15 plus 3 equals 18. Finally, x will be 3. Then, go to the other equation. 6x will be negative 12. Divided by 6, it will be negative 
to substitute in the uh, or, uh, equation with uh, x equal 3 and negative 2 to make sure that you are right finally x equal 3 and negative 2 or the solution set equal 3 comma negative 2 another example here here we have 2x minus 8 absolute 2x minus 8 plus 2 equal negative 22 first find the value of the absolute it will be negative 22 minus 2 means the negative 24 no answer for negative absolute no result there is no number inside the absolute the output of this absolute will be negative no answer absolute 2x minus 5 equal 3 that means 2x minus 5 equal 3 or negative 3 uh, 2x uh, solves the two, equation, two equations the first one 2x will be 8 means x equal 4 second one 2x will be negative 3 plus 5 means negative 8 uh, sorry means 2 to x negative 3 plus 5 equal 2 finally 2x equal 2 x equal 1 the solu solution set will be 1 comma 4 absolute x plus 8 equal 3 that means x plus 8 equal 3 or negative 3 I solve the two equations first one will be x equal uh, equal negative 5 second one will be negative 11 check the, your answer here we have x plus 8 equal 3 absolute negative 5 plus 8 equal 3 and also absolute negative 11 plus 8 equal 3 so the answer will be negative 5 comma negative 11 3d minus 9 absolute 3d minus 9 plus 6 equals 0 that means find the value of the absolute 3d minus 9 equal negative 6 finally it, the absolute value never be a negative number so the, there is no solution for this equation that means 5 3 times absolute x minus 5 equal 12 first remove this 3 it will be 3 times so I'm going to divide both uh, sides by 3 if I absolute x minus 5 equal 4 finally x minus 5 equal 4 or negative 4 that means equal x equal 9 or 1 check your answer 3 times 9 minus 5 equal 12 and 3 times 1 minus 5 equal 12 find the value of the absolute it will be 3 times 4 equal 12 and also 3 times absolute negative 4 equal 12 the two answers are right then the solution set equal nine. absolute 8 plus 5a equal 14 minus a first inside the absolute maybe the positive value or the negative value so 8 plus 5a may be equal 14 minus a or negative bracket 14 minus a solve the two equations first one will be 8 plus 5a equal 14 minus a and the second one would be 8 plus 5a equal negative 14 plus a then find the value of a negative a will uh, go to the other side it will be plus a that means 6 a equal 6 a finally equal 1 the other one 5a minus a it will be 4a equal negative 22 that means a equal negative 5.5 check your answer put a equal 1 and a equal negative 5.5 5 .5. and you find finally the two sides are right then the answer equal 1 and negative solution 3k minus 1 minus 4 equal 6 so I'm going to find the value of the absolute first it would be 6 plus 4 that means 10 then inside the absolute maybe 10 maybe negative 10 first equation will be 3x minus 1 equal 10 second one will be 3x minus 3k sorry minus 1 equal negative 10 find the value of k in the first equation it will be 3x equal 11 finally equal uh, k equal 11 over 3 go to the second one 3x equal 9 uh, sorry negative 9 finally k will be equal negative 3 the solution set will be negative 3 comma 11 over 3 
absolute x plus 7 plus 12 equals 7 first find the value of the absolute it will be x plus 7 absolute x plus 7 equal negative 5 no solution for this uh, uh, e equation because the answer is a negative number so finally it's 5 no solution absolute 2y plus 5 equals 0 of course I have here one case all uh, uh, 2y plus 5 will be equal 0 there is no negative 0 there is no number equal negative 0 okay so it will be 2y equal negative 5 that means y equal negative 5 over 2 finally the solution set equal negative 5 over 2 if we have absolute equal another absolute that means I'm going to change the sign in one of them any one of them that means maybe 2w plus 4 equal 3w minus 2 and 2w plus 4 equal negative 3w minus 2 solve the two equations first <coughs> minus 3w on both uh, sides negative finally it will be negative w equal 4 sorry plus 4 equal negative 2 negative w will be negative uh, 6 finally w equal <coughs> sorry 6 go to the other equation 2w plus 4 equal negative 3w plus 2 add 3w on uh, both sides finally it would be 5w plus 4 equal 2 5w equal 2 minus 4 negative 2 finally w equal negative 2 over 5 the solution set will be negative 2 over 5 comma 6 and you have to check your answer before write the solution set if we have absolute equal absolute we are going to change the sign of any of them first let x plus 2 equal 3k plus 3 then k plus 2 equal negative 3k plus 3 solve the two equations first one that means 2k plus 3 equal 2 finally 2k equal negative 1 that means k equal negative 1 over 2 go to the other one k plus 2 equal negative 3k minus 3 finally it will be 4k equal uh, 4k plus 2 equal negative 3 that means 4k equal negative 5 finally k equal negative 5 over 4 check your answer then write the solution set negative 5 over 4 and negative 1 over 2 another example here we have uh, absolute 2x minus 9 equal absolute 3 minus 2x first change the uh, uh, sign of any of them that means 2x minus 9 equal 3 minus 2x or 2x minus 9 equal negative 3 minus 2x then solve for x on uh, the two equations in the two equations first one uh, adding 2x for on both sides Finally, it will be 4x minus 9 equal 3. That means 4x equal 12. That means finally x equal 3. Here we have 2x minus 9 equal negative 3 plus 2x. Solve for x. So that means negative 9 equal negative 3. No solution in for this equation. Finally, the answer will be 3. After uh, check your answer, the solution set will be 3.